When you think of the future, you think of the kids of the present. Now these kids are gonna grow up to becoming the people that we are today. Kids will become, it will step into your shoes and will step into these old shoes. Us being young adults, we don't know the importance and realization because we're living in the moment right now. But kids are honestly our best aspect and our most important aspect to help develop in order to keep this country and this world civilized. Great morals and great people are what keep this world going round. So why not help donate and solving this problem and keeping kids out of the streets and putting them in safe environments so they can eat, learn, stay active, be social, make friends, and truly find themselves. Today, I will be talking about three main points for the need of children needing to be socializing and staying active as they grow up and the satisfaction with proper fundings, donations, and fine charity that can give children opportunities that will last them a lifetime as they grow. And three, visualizing picture, visualizing and picturing kids growing up to becoming good model citizens and knowing their true responsibilities and their true selves. Now, as we continue, first main point, staying active and being socialized. This is truly, truly, truly very important when it comes to a kid's development and growing up. According to canr.msu.edu, it's a website made by Michigan State University. The importance of a, of a kid staying active is crucial for, it, for many reasons. As it states a list of examples on why kids should stay active for example, one of them, kids who be who begin to stay active as a kid will keep will keep that thrive in them as they become young adults and to much older. That'll keep them from getting any other diseases such as type two diabetes or type one diabetes, um, who knows, heart disease, um, anything that has to do with unhealthy habits and diseases that can truly affect them in the long run um, exercising at a young age can truly prevent that being social is another key component and key um, term or fact that kids do need to help them grow because if a kid's not social then he's gonna he or she is going to be alone and very shy when they grow up. Thus not seizing the moment and having opportunities to become a better person or to get the job they want or to get the person they want or to get anything that they desire to have or to do. According to childrenscampus.com, it says that kids should be more social from the moment they start talking due to the developing, due to it developing their sense of self and finding out what they like and specific hobbies that they feel they'll be interested in. Now, if a kid doesn't have a hobby, then a kid's just there. All kids do have hobbies and it's mainly playing. But what's the fun in playing if you don't have any buddies to hang out with? Thus, the Boys and Girls Club being a perfect place for the kids to stay active, be social, make friends, and on top of that, help them. Second main point, satisfaction. Proper funding and donations uh, give many possibilities. Opportunities that kid that gives kids to have a place where they can find where they can be a kid and find themselves in the long run. On the Boys and Girls Club's website, it states that every kid has the has the right to a safe environment when it comes to just being a kid. Now nowadays, society has been kind of crazy lately, so it is kind of hard for a kid to 
go out and play and everything like that, especially with the pandemic going on. Now, the Boys and Girls Club are there and they're safe. And they also help kids get home safely. Scholarships are also offered to kids that were a part of the Boys and Girls Club when they graduate high school. Due to donations and proper fundings, the Boys and Girls Clubs can offer scholarships to kids who are a part of the club and can help them get a college education and become something important for society for the future generations after them. So basically what I mean is that because this kid got a scholarship from the Boys and Girls Club, the Boys and Girls Club helped that kid into college or pay for college and then become a doctor, a lawyer, or a teacher to help the future generations after them. So it's just an ever ending cycle when it comes to this. So that's why it's very important for donations and liquidity of, of money coming in and out of the Boys and Girls Club to help these kids as much as we can. Now the third main point is visualizing and seeing kids succeeding and making a better generation. The generations nowadays are kind of crazy. But with the right role models and the right people around kids, they should know and they will know what is right and what is wrong. Morals are easy to know. But kids thriving when growing up due to the right role models, it's easier for them. Within the About Us page on the website of the Boys and Girls Club, it says about 90% of children can go to a worker when doing a crisis in their life. Now that's pretty big because not a lot of kids like to talk about problems going on at home with just anybody. So if they have a safe haven for free at the Boys and Girls Club, they feel that they can help any problem that's going on at home. They can get advice from a, from a role model or someone who can relate and help them get through tough times, help them do school, help them become a better person. Great mentors and safe environments for all children. According to the Boys and Girls Club org, clubs could be the best place a kid can go to after school, especially if a children if a children's parents are at work. It can ensure them to do better in academic health and overall proper manners and respectfulness. In the end, it is always it, it always starts with the children. The Boys and Girls Club are a, tr are a clear, true picture on helping kids become better people in this world and teach them the morals of life. Please go out and donate for the kids. <sighs> Please go out and donate for the kids so they can have a better future. And the kids are the future. So let's make sure the future is handed into the right hands and so on to come. Thank you.